Yeah, well, there's lots of uh, vacant land in this area, so it you know, speaks to you don't see vacant land up on the north side. You know, it says something about the condition of the community, the economic condition of the community that people are able to sustain. You don't see these kind of you know, houses here, and then you know, a whole block of vacant land, and then another house. Unless you're out in the country somewhere. You know, this is in you know the, the height of I mean the heart of an urban area. Yeah. So you, you, know, you don't see that kind of thing. So I was just looking at the signs raising the question. What you have to do, you have to make like a list of things, right. paperwork, explain it, what you're trying to do, how to try, try to uh, uplift the uh, neighborhood, have somebody pass them out, canvas the area, okay. certain stores, put put up book, billboard, or two, that people recognize to be aware of. A lot of people don't people come outside that much as you think. Well, I didn't know where they're Okay, so I'm, I'm just, this is only my assumption. So you, you, know, you get the paperwork, you put out everything down, what you're standing for, what you can do, the positive things. Uh, and uh, that would probably motivate or stimulate people's imagination. Because, you know, he play, fails to plan, plans to fail. So as a collective bargaining group, as we're speaking, if we all just come together and just have opinions and write them on paper and evaluate it, then we probably can come up with a solution. Insulation, I think, is wonderful. Uh, you know, I, I think it, uh, it allows us, the uh, community, to come together and to be able to, to interact uh, on the value of, of community. To think about how we are individually mostly changed, maybe transformed. The need to be more dynamic and compassionate uh, toward each other in order to uh, resolve what problems or issues we're facing. Each of us individually are growing, and, uh, and our collaboration as organizations grow as well. But, uh, I'm just just happy, I'm happy, blessed to be here. Really, I see those who showed up. Uh, is all it needs to be here. Yeah. It's a way of our coming together as a nucleus that, and in a, as a seed, in such a way that these grounds here that lot, bare lots, will grow just like the uh, fruits of a plant will grow. And so I'm looking forward to what comes out of it. It's exciting. I think I think this is uh, I think this is uh, community healthy. I think this is uh, what should be done in a community where you have the, uh, the sort of uh, uh, outreach that uh, 
least raise the question, what can be more productive for Ghana with making areas like this? So I think this is great. I'm pleased to see something like this. At this particular line, well, it's a good idea. It's a positive thing, and it allows the uh, populace in the general area, I would assume, to uh, put forth their ideas about what could be done with the lot. And uh, it's, uh, it's going to be random thoughts, no doubt, which is a good thing, too, because you get a variety of different thoughts. But I think uh, community center, swimming pool, uh, what else? Playground, park. People would think pretty much on that general uh, level. Although Washington Park, which is a massive park, is a short distance from here, you know. I never really thought much on it, but th those would be my immediate thoughts. My name is Russell Harris. I feel like we need more events like this to sort of keep the spirit of our community alive, keep the art alive, keep the community alive and growing and blossoming. I mean, there's a lot of bad and there's a lot of good at the same time, but the good isn't always brought to the forefront. We're not reminded of some of the historical events that have taken place over the years. There's so much history in the neighborhood like this. I mean, a lot of people that we talk about in African history or history all? period have walked these streets, performed here, lived here, um, earned legacy here, raised families here. And um, there's really nothing left that kind of reminds us of that. And, Educates the people about our history as African Americans, as Chicagoans, um, as Americans. In general. So um, it's good to see things like this in the neighborhood where there's so many negative things going on, um, so much turmoil, and not a very good economy. But still, I mean, it means a lot. And, uh, I think more people should be aware of it, but that, that comes from time. I mean, eventually people, a lot more people start to know about things like this. If we keep it going, and all we have to do is stick with it. And that's basically it. Thank you.